it or we won't stand a chance. We need to get from here to there. Make sure the big boy doesn't find whatever he's looking for. Good strategy. It's dangerous, though. That's a lot of open ground to cover. All right, sport. Looks like it's me and you. Let's go across Times Square and get into the building Stay Puft is so interested in. You guys keep him off us if you think you can. He knows you're there, Ray. I don't think he likes it. Yeah, he spotted us. Keep moving. Keep away from those feet. He'll stomp you into jelly. Those on darts should do the trick. We'll loosen them up. Boson will loosen them up. Nice boson. That really dinged him. Great job. Now see if he wants s'more. Get it? I'm funny too, you know. Here he comes! He made some maneuvers! Stick close to me and as far away from him as you can. Bankman, you've got to distract him. Megman, are you getting coffee? Megman's getting coffee. Boson darts! Boson will loosen him up. No, follow me, quick! Draw him over here! Just a level 5 thought form cross rip. The professionals are here. Everybody calmly exit the street. Make no sudden movements. What the? Scan it for the guide now. Good track. He didn't find what he was looking for on the bottom floors. Come on, we've got to get to the top floors. All full, going up. Uh, he, uh, just passed gas. Catch the next one. Relax, sir. We handle foul vapors all the time. Let's stay in for lunch, you said. Why leave the building, you said. It'll be quiet, you said. You know you're fired. You're right. I secretly knew our lives would be in danger and thought, Hey, I'll make sure I trap Mark with me inside an elevator! Excuse us. Stay with me, Haas. I'm sure there's more fun up ahead. Oh, Nick. Could be trouble.
keep an eye out. Jump out of the way! See what's here. Man, this place is chewed up. Good shooting. Ah! Night and shining proton pack time. Beckman, come in, please. Pandemonium up here. Chunks of the building missing everywhere. You are required at the site now. So happy to be in demand, but these sugar balls have got me nailed down. I can't get past them. They're disgusting. And they're unhealthy. Ah, uh, did I mention there's a spectacularly beautiful lady in distress? I'll be right there. Sudden movements. You're perfectly safe now. Sudden movements! Sudden movements! Wow! Check it out, kid! What a view, huh? Manhattan. I love it. Uh, well, you're just lucky to have met someone as special as me, okay? It's okay. Dr. Venkman has you. You're fine now. You didn't spill your coffee, did you, Peter? Ray, I got coffee for all of us. But the little monster spilled it. And what's the story with those things, anyway? What? Was that a manifestation of Gozer? Uh, yeah, probably. It just may be. Could be. Would you like to take the most direct route out of here, or the scenic route to its lady's choice? There's a stairwell over here. Let's go. Woo! Yeah, Grace under pressure. I appreciate that, in a lady. Okay, Slugger, let's you and me do this quick and quiet, before Tubby Soft Squeeze out there figures out what we're up to. I think Tubby Soft Squeeze has dog ears, Ray. We're not getting 
Out of here that way. Well, it was a good plan for a second. Okay, let's think. What did people do before stairs? Was it ladders or just jumping from high? We go up then. To the roof. Well, how you? Stay puffed, spotted us. Move, move. Well, that's some relief. Come on, let's go. from 54th Street to 5th Avenue. Happy Thanksgiving! Here he goes! The big evil sailor all the way to the... Oh! Not quite. Didn't make it. Hey, Ray, say three guys the size of your finger knocked you off the side of a 30-story building and you had to climb all the way back up to tear them apart. How, how mad would you be at those three little dinky types? I'd go with Mighty Pissed. Uh -huh. Okay, and throw in a sugar high, too. That giant blue and white toy man thing, or whatever, is still coming. It's climbing the building. I'm impressed with his agility, considering his complete lack of bones. Good news. We've got the Super Slammer back on pulse, and Ecto-1 is rolling. We're repositioning now. Can you hold the Stay Puft there for a few minutes? If by few you mean less than one, then sure, we can do that. Hey, did somebody tell you it was break time? No sweat, kid. We've got you. Well, as long as you're down there, would you see if you could knock off Mr. Sweetness? All right there, sunshine. Are you okay? You're all strapped in. We've got a good tight grip on your belt. Here he comes! The Big Daddy Manifestation himself! A raging blob of densely packed marshmallow! Oh boy! Melt him, Chief! Get 
give him full screen! He's right, rookie. Your health insurance doesn't begin for another 89 days. More of those minis. How many can he generate? From 200,000 square feet of solid marshmallow? Mm -hmm. Probably 60. Ozon darts should do the trick. Is that his upset look? What do you think? Soften him up with your boson darts! Got him on the rope, Flapsker! Land the last one so we can go home! You've killed my dessert! Scoreboard reads Ghostbusters 2, Gozer the Gozerian 0. Looking like a real big leaguer out there, champ. Ray, Peter, we're in position. The trap is set. We're prepared to capture Stay Puff. Where is he? He's that white puddle you're driving through? Timing's off by just a hair, Egon, but we're glad the trap is working again. I guess I owe you guys my life. She's clean. How do you feel? Pretty good. All extremely weird things considered. So far, just another screwed up day at the office. You know, I never forget a face attached to all the rest of that. I think we met earlier at the Sedgwick Hotel. You gave me the sideshow chicken drop. My name's Alyssa, Dr. Alyssa Selwyn, and- I am Dr. Peter Venkman, and that's Egon. It's uh, Ray, Winston, and uh, you met him. Uh-huh, the Ghostbusters. Have you ever been involved in this type of quantum temporal rift event before? A quantum what? It's called arcing, a large pulse of psychic energy. Actually, yes. I was at the museum. A pulse of blue light surged through the building, and then I was standing outside a room on the 13th floor of an old hotel. The Sedgwick. The Sedgwick doesn't have a 13th floor. It was pulling me like a magnet. I felt as though I was in a deep dream. I came to and ran over here. Here? It's a temporary office while I'm in town. I came to do some research after I woke up. We'd like you to come to our lab so we can run some brief tests and ask you more questions. Here's an easy one. Would you like to go out for Thai, Mexican, Japanese? Wow, Dr. Venkman. That time you almost went 45 seconds without saying something abrasive. Want to try for a whole minute next time? A doctor and a fiery one too. Charming. So charming. So you know so much about Gozer because... Because I'm a specialist in ancient Mesopotamian cultures and architecture. Sumerian primarily. Gozerian more specifically. I'm here as a guest curator for the Gozerian exhibit that's opening tomorrow at the Natural History Museum. You are aware that we also have some history with Gozer. Yes, of course. Gozer was a bush leaguer before he met us. A strictly farm team deity. We put him on the map. But our getting stiffed on invites to opening night, just an oversight, right? I don't have anything to do with that. That, gentlemen, was all me. And I can assure you, it was not an oversight. Oh, by the way, you have visitors. Thanks, Janine your first-class lookout. Walter Peck, I did not recognize you without the mayor's backside attached to your nose. Okay, everybody put them back in their skivvies. <laughs> Apologies. Uh, Dr. Selwyn, are you all right? I think so, but I'm worried about the exhibit. Are you kidding? You can't buy publicity like this. The guest curator of the Gozer exhibit 
The expert Peck recommended is attacked the night before the opening by Gozer himself. Please tell me that was Gozer. Gozer manifested in a familiar form, one he had used before, the Stay Puffed Marshmallow Man, but this event was weaker than his first encounter with us. Ha! Huh, that's all I need! Thanks! Come on, Jock. What's the idea of bringing Prack around here? Oh, have I coughed at the wrong time? <laughs> Listen, here's the deal. You and Peck and all you guys are going to work together. What? No way, no how. Impossible. Look. This city has given you at least a dozen contracts for the jails, courthouses, and wharves. You guys want to grow your business. Get some county and state work, too. I'm all for it. You've been big supporters and great for my campaign. Well, some have said our endorsement is what got you elected. But not out loud. Anyway, after all the damage you've been causing lately, the city council wants you under close supervision for a period of no less than six months. We file reports on time. There's no need for extra supervision. <laughs> Funny guy, Bankman. You've always been my favorite. Well, that's why your old friend Peck comes in. He's annoying, a stickler for the rules. In other words, the perfect Peck for the job. He's our new head of Peacock. Peacock? P-C-O-C, Paranormal Contracts Oversight Commission. And my first official act is going to be suspending you clown's operating license. Lighten up, Peck. Launch your investigation if you have to, but for now, just keep them under control and my office in the loop. But remember, if the Ghostbusters cease to exist, so does your job. So you need each other. Beautiful in an ironic, symmetrical kind of way, isn't it? Hey, Mulligan, come on. It's Mayor Mulligan to you, Venkman. So, we have an understanding? This kind of protects us all. You want more government business, I want to keep my approval rating, and Peck wants his little fiefdom. You play by the rules. Easy. We all get what we want, and the city council gets what they need. Okay, big night tomorrow, Alyssa. Get some rest. So, now that we're all friends, can we get invites to the museum opening? Not likely. But I'll be seeing you soon. You can count on that. Doesn't Peck... Look exactly like...